Blindness is a public health problem, in more so in the developing countries. In India, 1.1 million people are blind co with corneal blindness. We can perform only 25,000 keratoplasties. The need is one lakh penetrating keratoplasties. Why this gap? The question is still not clearly answered. When I see when I see a dead body is burning or a body is cremated or some body is taken to morgue, I feel sad but a little bit greedy too. Because the soul has left, but with the sparkling cornea is there. I started doing keratoplasty during my last days of internship at Calcutta, Eye Infirmary, Regional Institute of Ophthalmology. Of course, that was <coughs> therapeutic keratoplasty for a perforated corneal ulcer. So what is the answer for this gap, to fill up the gap between the need and supply? We need robust eye banking. I was standing in front of casualty ward in Bukharo General Hospital, Jharkhand. A man asked me, he was in tears, that can I donate? My father's was just now expired his eyes. I had no answer because we didn't add any eye bags. I cut a sorry figure. That day I had the dream of opening an eye bag in a small place of Bukharo Steel City. We have to try hard to get the nod first from our authorities to convince them, then to get license from government as per Human Organ Transplant Act. Ultimately, 26 January, the Republic Day 2013, Eye Bank and Cornea Transplantation Center was open, established. But the criteria was no extra finance or human resource will be provided. We waited, we took different innovative steps, we took fridge, we took industrial thermometer to maintain the temperature. I found some stainless steel tree fines. We used jam bottles, small jam bottles with wide mouth for carrying sterilized, for carrying the donated eyeball. After waiting for a month, though the list for recipient went beyond thousand, I got the call from a nearby village. <coughs> I went there and enucleated. I enucleated the whole eye without disfiguring the dead body. Lady was sitting beside, old lady. I asked her why she is sitting. Her answer was inspiring. She told her husband's last wish was to donate her eye, uh, donate his eyes so that somebody can see in this world. She wanted her husband's last wishes fulfilled. We inoculated whole eye because it can be used, it was used for training our postgraduate students TNB students, diplomats of National Board students. We have two DNB residents every year and they were very excited. We, we <coughs> had taken uh, the recipients for opaque cornea and 
After the donor button was removed, they were taught to stitch, suture that corneal button. And they were also taught to see the consistency of lenses by cutting it with knives. We gradually performed in two years around 14 cases, 10 cases or 10 cases. Two cases had rejection. We didn't have specular microscope. We used the slit lamp specular microscopy, specular illumination to see the endothelium of the donor. My first case was very much interesting and very much intrigued for me, challenging rather. She was one-eyed patient. Only I was operated for IUL and glaucoma. She had pseudopathic bullous keratopathy to perform surgery. And she could see. However, her vision lasted only for one year. Her vision gone when she died. So, doing keratoplasty is one of the finest corneal surgery possible. Nowadays, a lot of developments have come. The real challenge lies to establish a cornea transplant center and <coughs> eye band. These are all situated in big institutes, teaching colleges, with a not so good results. So my aim was, from this experience of eight years, what we learned is public awareness is important, but people pledges come in front for pledging their eyes after death. But end stage caregiver, medical personnel, critical care specialist, anesthetist, neurosurgeon, they are not always convinced. They have to be convinced by collaborating with different societies during their annual conferences and other workshops, inviting them. In Bokaro General Hospital, being a multi specialty, 910 bedded hospital, on an average, weekly 25 to 30 deaths occur. Within these eight years, I could get only six eyes from there. Such was the poor response from the colleague. So a relook into this awareness among the peers is required. Spiritual meets is again another problem. The answer is establishing an eye bank, functional eye bank and cornea transplant center. From a paper boat, a blind man can go to an illuminated boat towards the horizon. Thank you.